today. Alright, cool. Just let me know when you are. Skill less. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go, buddy. Additional supply depots. Not enough minerals. Not enough minerals. In the rear with the gear. SCV ready. Not enough minerals. Я играю в StarCraft, она дала. Oh, he actually pulled SCVs against that. Well, I'm totally fine with that. He pulled two SCVs to defend that. I'm very pleased with that. Not enough minerals. SCV ready. Not enough minerals. Cyclone on route. What's up? Not enough. S Our SCVs are under attack. Command center upgrade complete. He just donated so much to me, it's not even funny. Thank you. That was just really, really impatient on his part. Not enough minerals. Game 
closed. Mm -hmm. Not enough minerals. Additional supply depots required. SCV ready. Raven online. I can't build here. Go, go, go! Additional Not enough minerals. Not enough minerals. Additional supply depots. Not enough minerals. Not enough minerals. Not enough minerals. Not enough minerals. Armed and ready. SCV ready. Not enough minerals. SCV ready. Not enough minerals. Not enough. Ready to plunder. Not enough minerals. Been waiting. SCV ready. SCV ready. Not enough minerals. Order. This better be good. Ready to plunder. In the rear with the Ready to plunder. By the number. You gonna give me a move on? Not enough minerals. Yo, yeah, what's up, Dust? Additional supply depots required. Not enough energy. Additional supply depots required. Ready to plunder. This is all in, folks. What's going on? SCV ready. Attacking off of three barracks on two bases is all in. Add on. We could use some help here. Not enough energy. Command center upgrade. Upgrade complete. Not enough minerals. Not enough minerals. Go, go, go! Comms over. Research complete. Mineral field add on complete.
completed. Not enough minerals. Not enough minerals. Goodness gracious, dude, just leave the game. Not enough minerals. Wait, no. Gracious, man. here <laughs> I don't I don't get people like this man so like you're obviously BMing me when you're saying all in actually I don't even think it was uh I don't even remember if he you know used a question mark like he was asking me but then I say no I don't really feel like continuing the BM. I'm, I'm kind of a bit too tired. Sometimes I'm in the mood to continue BM. Right now I'm not. But, uh, alright, let's see. Let's scroll back. I'll watch the game just to, uh, I kind of, I, in the first engagement, when I said he didn't need to force that, I was going to make a comment to the effect that I could tell that he wasn't very good, at least not in TVT anyway. It's one of those skill checks that first attack with the Reaper Hellion. And when you just dive on top of everything. Now I'm BMing. <laughs> there we go. We did it, boys. <laughs> that 
the post-game chat win. The post-game chat victory after the in-game victory. <laughs> oh my goodness. I was being so polite to him. Are you kidding me? I'm like, I'm, you know, I'm even being friendly. Cause I, as I said, sometimes I'm in the mood to engage in the BM trash talk. I'm really not right now. But like, how stupid do you have to be to continue that? All right, I think I think we're gonna do a BM review. I'm I'm not gonna play a bunch of ladder games today. That might actually be my last one. So if anyone wants to practice, I'll practice. I'm just not feeling it today. Um. Yeah, it's just one of those days. I'm lucky to have gone two and zero, but I'm not feeling that I'm playing super solidly. So I'm not gonna push it. Just gonna chill. Two ladder games is fine, but I will play lots of practice games if anyone wants. But before that, we're gonna do a new segment. I used to do it back in the day, but I never had a name for it. But this is BM Review, okay? I remember when I used to do this, when people would come up with particularly stupid BM, you know, accuse you of all inning or cheesing or whatever, and they were just completely wrong. But then they doubled down on it. So here we go. This one's going on YouTube. Folks, welcome to the BM Review segment where we take our opponent's BM. We examine it, we analyze it, we try to gain some insight into what might be happening with their psychology, assuming that they have a brain um, in which psychology might play a factor. I understand that this might be a generous assumption in some cases, such as with our friend Skillless here, but we are going to give him the benefit of the doubt. We're going to take the high road. We are going to assume that he has a functioning brain, even if it's only semi-functioning, and we're going to try to get inside of that brain. Try to figure out what's going on you know what's behind the messages what's behind the feeling behind the messages so let's get into the game and let's see if we can figure out uh what was going through skillless's mind and then subsequently through his fingers as he typed nasty little messages to me yo what's up ken <laughs> i will scroll back through chat after this and uh, make sure I didn't miss anything. But we've got to do the BM review now. As I said, this is going on YouTube. This is obviously high quality content. This is why 31 people have subscribed to my YouTube channel. So we've, we've got to give the masses what they require. In all actuality, this was a rather... I don't know if I'd say boring game. I mean, there was action from the, the start of the game to the finish. Just FYI, so you don't think I ignored him. I said I always say GLHF during the intro screen. Um, so please believe me. I swear I did. I was not ignoring our good friend here. I also I I graciously allowed him to pause. You know, which you know should be standard. It's not like a big deal, but it was a a well mannered game, a gentleman's game, if you will, a macro game at that. Yo, Dust, remind me after this BM review to get uh, to get back to you on that. I'm going to get back to everything in chat. But as I was saying, so first and foremost, we're going to come up upon his, his initial attack, which was way too committed. Uh, I don't know. Did he even know I had? No. So he didn't know I had an expansion on the low ground. Now, it's certainly not unusual in TVT especially with these Reaper Hellion openers. He went for the extra. So this was the difference here in our build. Uh, I understand that I'm actually at a disadvantage here. It's kind of funny because I obliterated him in this engagement. But as we can see, he goes three Hellions, uh, actually five Reapers. Um, okay, I, I'm, I'm assuming I, I could rewind if I want, but it's not that interesting. Um, I'm assuming he produced off of a, a reactor. Anyway, uh, there are times, especially when I go proxy starport, where I will go up to a third Hellion and a fourth Reaper just to put on even more pressure at their natural. So this is somewhat similar to that. I know that it's a possibility, and I know that I can kind of get wiped out here if my factory unit isn't out in time. Fortunately, it was. He did kill a couple of SCVs, I believe. But you're going to see what I was talking about earlier. He doesn't even poke in, I don't think. No, he just runs straight in. So that's fine. He's going to get SCVs. That's not a problem. But I, I pull back here and wait for my Cyclone to join up. 
And so right here, this is when he needs to just completely pull back. As soon as my Cyclone is here, he needs to get the heck out of here. He's already killed three SCVs. He's created a nice little advantage for himself. Um, you know, I think what he has lost... What has he lost? He lost one Reaper. I think just what one Reaper and one SCV so far. So he's in great shape. I'm not going to over-pursue this. I'll get a kill with my Cyclone, but then I'm going to pull back. But instead, uh, to be true to his name, which I respect, he comes back to fight this, knowing that he is going to get obliterated, and we see how the rest of that turned out. But again, it was to defend the honor of his name, which he did successfully. It is it is no misnomer. So we're going to fast forward a little more, because again, this really wasn't that interesting of a game. I'm guessing this was a ninja base? Either that, or he just never landed it. Um, he never scouted me. He did send out a couple of marines later, but um, unless I missed the scan, maybe he scanned my base and, and saw my tech. But, um, you know, I've got some map vision right now. He's trying to establish it. But my push is already on the map right now. So his marine just spots it there. He pulls back his third. Um, by the way, we're about to see the initial BM. Mr. Gramps, what is up, man? Great to see you. I'm going to briefly look at chat. Dust says, a gentleman's game between two honorable Terran players playing a macro game. Indeed. I, you guys can't see it. I need to get a hand cam. But the whole time I played this game, my pinky was raised on my mouse. As though it were a cup of tea. So, it was super honorable. Alright. So, this is the all-in, according to Skillless. Three racks. Uh, I'm going to get my third base pretty soon. I was pumping units off of this constantly. Uh, we see that his macro is on point. Um, I don't mean with respect to being a good player. I mean in keeping in alignment with his name skillless. So yes, it is perfect in that regard. No skill whatsoever. Uh, yeah, he just gets obliterated here. Let's fast forward. We're going to fast forward. Uh, this is a BM review. So we want to get to, straight to the BM. Uh, the game is over. He has no hope of coming back from this. He's been out traded at nearly 4-1. to one. Uh, Technic all in. Okay, there we go. So, yeah, so he wasn't even asking a question. He's telling me all in. So I say no. <laughs> he says yes. So let's uh, take a look here, folks. Third base, halfway done. All of this pressure was off of three barracks, one factory, and a starport. Uh, I only have my single eBay now, but I'm about to add my second eBay for the double upgrades. Yep, and adding racks four and five. So let's take a, a quick pull in the chat. Does Skillless know something that I don't? At the point you attacked, you were on 111. Complete all. Yeah, exactly. The, uh, the infamous 111 two base timing all in it's a timing all in you ha you hit the third and then you add racks two and three and then the third base and then racks four and five as a deception in case he scans so when he scans and like and when i start saturating the third with scvs and harvesting additional resources it's all a bluff i'm not even going to use those resources that's the trick you see, and that's how you get them. That's how you win, folks. It's an all-in. You harvest the resources, um, but again, gentleman's agreement, you don't spend them because secretly you're all-in off of two bases. So, here we go. Let's continue. You don't have third. Um, but did he ever even scan me? I don't think he... No, he never... Okay, so I was right. He never scouted me. After that initial attack, he didn't scout me once. He has no clue about uh, my third. He, he doesn't even know for that matter. I mean, he knows that I have bio because I attacked him, but he doesn't know about my tech. He knows nothing. So you don't have a third. This is an illusion. Ignore it. As I said, it's fake. It doesn't matter anyway. We don't use those resources. We put them in a savings account for a future game. As I said, the game is over, but we are here for the BM now. Today I learned three racks on two bases all in. Fascinating. And that is true. I did learn that today. I wasn't aware of it. 
I bet most of you weren't aware of that either. Oh, and that, wait, here we go. It is all in. Oh, <laughs> wait, I actually kind of missed that. Hold on. I actually missed that during the game. See, in the heat of battle, I, he is acknowledging the fact that um, that it was three, <laughs> that it was three racks off of two bases. I actually didn't realize that. So he genuinely thinks that going three racks on two bases is all in. That's amazing. But you know what? Again, let's you know let's give him credit. There may have been a point in time where he played someone on ladder in Silver League, um, you know, which I'm sure wasn't too long ago. But uh, where they went all in, maybe they pulled the boys with three racks, and this gave him flashbacks. As I said, the point of this segment is to try to get inside, you know, whatever placebo for a brain that Skillless has, try to understand what's behind the BM. Can we have a non-cheese game next, please, streamer? <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, I'll, I'm, I'm sorry for the cheese and all-in games frame show. You have my sincerest apologies. I, I will refrain from doing these gimmicky three racks, uh, three racks, two base pressure builds. But yeah, so in Silver League, one day, Skillless you know, perhaps ran into the dreaded three racks, two base all-in. Maybe the boys were pulled. Maybe they weren't pulled. They don't even need to be. I mean, it's three barracks, for crying out loud, off of two bases that hits at, you know, seven minutes or whatever it is. And this game here, it, just, it gave him flashbacks. And the game was so distinct, that previous experience was so distinct to him, that as soon as this army showed up at his base, he was just like, not again. Not again. Not like this. But in fact, it was again, and it was like this. It, it was all in. So, you know, I think through... Here we go. Wait, let's get back to this quickly. Um, because you said all in, and then no. no. You want to, dude, you are dumb. That's it. Okay. I mean, fair point. If you've watched the stream, I certainly can't argue uh, in favor of my intellect based on some of the games that you've seen. You know, we'll be, you know, we'll, we'll be fair here. See, I tried to close it on a positive note. Thanks for the points. You know, not uh, not insulting. Just thank you and express gratitude and uh, wish him good luck on the ladder. I even compliment his intellect. As I said, it's a gentleman. All right, folks. Can we see the four? Yeah, there we go. There we go. <laughs> see, Mr. Gramps is catching on. He's a, Mr. Gramps is a quick study. The four base on. <laughs> yeah. The four base all in, and then the um, the following game we'll do the split map all in. You know, of course you have to have all of the bases on your side of the map, and then the opponent has all of the bases on his side of the map, uh, and from that point you go all in. So there we go. Let's scroll back a little bit. Why is everybody such an these days? Again, I'm just trying to. De-escalate, dude. It's all good. I wasn't all in. Not even close. Standard three racks, two base, which we know is a lie, which I learned is not even true. So I apologize for that. Uh, but anyway, when you accuse someone of going all in, and they tell you truthfully that they're not, it's BM to say that they're wrong and they're actually all in. Anyway, no hard feelings. GG. Don't know what to say besides idiots. <laughs> anyway, so I think the rest of this speaks for itself, folks. I'm glad we did that segment, the BM review. I think this will probably be a recurring segment, as it seems to happen quite a bit on ladder. I enjoyed it. I hope you guys did as well. And I, I hope that you guys, as, as I did, gained an increased understanding for the psychology um, of this particular player. And I think we can all empathize. You know, in the end, three racks on two bases is just, you know, it, it's as cheesy as it gets. And there's no turning back. Once you leave the base, in fact, once you leave the base with that 1-1-1 production, you know, we can argue at that point, the all-in is already, it's set in stone. You turn back to your base from there and it's game over. You have to do damage with that 1-1-1 infrastructure off of two bases. You add racks two and three, it's just overkill. And as I said, I admitted, the third base, it was a lie. The third base was just a lie. Even when I produced SCVs there, it was just so that when he scanned, he would be deceived by it. So, anyway, I hope this was a learning experience for everyone else, as it certainly was for me. 
uh, and I'd like to express my gratitude to Skillless uh, for providing me uh, with the opportunity to grow. All right, that's going to be it for the BM review. Um, time for me to get back to chat and hopefully play some practice games, but uh, that'll do it for the YouTube segment.